What is up guys, Mom here. Today we're going to be setting up this. As you can see, I got this R4 SDHC RTS Lite. Two of them, one for my brother and one for my friend. And it came with these. I tried fixing it, but somehow there's a problem. I have another R4, but it's built-in games in it. It's kind of like an R4. But... I'm going to play it, there's like this error. See? And I'm going to fix that. So what you're going to do is take one of these. I'll just put my game back in there. If this doesn't work too, I'll try to fix it. So then, you take your SD card. I'll take this USB thing. Put it in there. I'll just, I'll just put it in. Okay. Now I just plug it into your computer, laptop, or Mac. But there will be something you maybe your Mac doesn't have, like how my Mac does. And so here you have it. I'm just going to have to format this. So, you go to Launchpad, or like, you can format it. Right-click and format on the on the Windows, but I have a Mac, so go to Other, click Disk Utility, and then click this, right-click it, press Erase. You see, it has to be like something other than x fat it's like i don't remember the name like something 32 fat 32 but i'm just going to format it or i could just erase you know just format it sorry about that i'm a little sick i have the on your nose okay now that you've formatted it you're going to have to go to you type r 4 dsorg and you scroll down and you click your R4 like whatever it is here like this is the one I have As you can see it's the same exact one And then you click on the language, so I'll just click English. It should be downloading right now. Yep, it's a little laggy to be downloaded. So once you're done downloading, so for now, I'm just going to go to SROMs. I prefer WoW ROMs. This is really good. So I just search anything, like for example, Metroid, Prime Hunters, like any game. Enter. And then by the time you download the ROM and stuff, because now that you've got this, just drag it to your desktop. Okay, now that you see it here, this is it. Just copy it and paste it to your SD card. Then you create a folder called DS Games or something. I named it Game because originally it's called Game, so. Just download your ROM now. Just, um, click download. I have to wait. You click now that it's downloading here. Let's see. You probably just need to wait a few seconds. 
so while it's downloading you can add a folder called game as you can see I added already added games to it just add it here and then you can add a homebrew if you want it doesn't come with it see I got myself a homebrew you can just write homebrew folder I don't know something like that I bought a kernel and it came with this thing, homebrew. Just go to drag it there. So, as you can see, I have this game. It's not SpongeBob or Lannis Scrapanis. I have the same, but it's not. It's like a fake R4 card. See, it has this loading screen and it turns into like this kind of, I don't know, and then it turns yellow and this happens. So, I'm gonna try to fix that. So, now that you've got your ROM downloaded and everything, just go back to the folder, drag this game to the folder, make sure it's over there. Go, it's downloading. And then close everything, you eject the disk, there you go, take out your SD card, put it under R4, but I just have to blow it because it doesn't work, I have to blow it, it's like something wrong with my 3DS, <laughs> or this sometimes happens to you, but it doesn't come with an SD card, so I got myself one. So you should get yourself one. It can come with one. It's rare. You can get one that already has. It. So <coughs> now that I got my R4, just have to like. <sighs> it's not used to. It's used to 3DS games. It's like some different. So. It won't really work, but you're going to need the FAT32 format, I think. But, it's going to stay like that, but if you have to format it correctly, it's going to work. So I'm going to record a video formatting it. Or no, I won't. I'll just... So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you like and subscribe. I hope this will help you, but you have to format it FAT32, something like that other than these all right so i'm just gonna be fixing this game i'll uh, record a video thanks for watching guys don't forget to like and subscribe see you later bye